Hey guys, it's Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. I think these are some of my favorite videos. I love doing hot new shit videos. I love sharing my favorite things with you guys. I love helping you guys ball on a budget. If there's stuff you want to check out, I usually have some kind of like deal or code I can give you guys to save some money. I've got a ton of new stuff to show you guys today. Lifestyle, skincare, makeup, jewelry, clothes, fashion. That's everything I think. If you guys want to see a bunch of my favorite hot new shit, First, if you're new here, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And if you want to hear about all these things that I'm obsessed with right now, you can go ahead and keep on watching this video. Everything will be linked in the description box down below on YouTube. I will have links to each item so you can check them out and anything I have a discount code on, I will also have listed for you guys so that you can save some money and ball on a budget too. An additional disclaimer, I am not being paid by any of these companies to say any of these things. Most of these things I've purchased with my own money. Um, no one's paying me to say I like these products. I only give you guys my honest opinions on things. If you guys knew the amount of random comes in my inbox that people want me to talk about on YouTube, you would die. And sometimes it's like the most weird, random, awkward things that I feel like an Amazon no-name company over in like China just finds me and is like, hey, we wanna send you this. And it's like something totally weird and random that I would never use and yeah. So I want you guys to know that I only talk to you about things that I actually use, like, and enjoy. And none of these companies are paying me to give you my opinion, but some of the links are affiliate links, just so you are aware. But let's jump right in and I'm gonna be doing makeup first. First of all, with it being summer, with it being warmer outside, sunscreen is going to be your best friend as far as anti-aging, fighting off wrinkles, dry spots, sun damage. This is one of my favorite tinted moisturizers for summer. I've been using this for years. I'm about to go on a trip to Florida and I totally plan on taking this to make sure my face doesn't burn. I used this in Mexico and my face never burnt. It is the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer moisturizer and it has SPF 30. I find that this is enough to keep me from burning and then I'll kind of reapply my extra sunscreen throughout the day, but this gives really good light coverage. It's enough coverage, but not heavy to where you can wear it to the beach or to the pool and you're not going to feel like you have any makeup on, but it's just going to give you a really smooth, glowing complexion. Now I've mentioned these sponges in one of my other videos, but they are the Beaky Blending Beauty Sponges. So they're basically a beauty blender dupe. They are sold on Amazon. You can get a five pack of these for like 10 bucks and I'm telling you, they are freaking amazing. They are all I've been using lately. I've been telling everybody else to use them. Everybody I know has been buying them. And just to show you guys, they do expand just like the beauty blenders do when damp and ignore the dirty one, but I have been using this nonstop. I use it for my foundation, for my powder, for my concealer, for my highlighter. I literally use it for everything. And the last makeup related item I have for you guys is actually a lip combo. It is what I have on now. I really like nude lip colors. I feel like I don't have to touch them up as often. They go with a lot of things. They don't clash with anything. And these are actually two items that I have used on and off for years. And I've recently fallen back in love with them and wondered why I ever stopped using them. It is the MAC Whirl Lip Liner. That is the infamous Kylie Jenner Lip Liner. And then it is the Blankety Lipstick. So Blankety is just this really pretty like nude pink shade. It's a little bit creamier formula, but I find that it still stays on pretty well. And this liner shade goes with so many different lipsticks. I use it all the time. I literally have like five at a time because I lose them. I have one in my purse. I have one in my kit. Like I have them everywhere. So these two together though are my perfect go-to everyday nude lip. I know it's always going to look good. I know it matches everything. And it's such a like universally good combo that it works on like any skin tone. So next we're going to do skincare and I have a couple items to show you guys. First is my favorite lip balm. This is the C Bigelow Night, what is it called? My favorite night balm. So it's an eight hour overnight lip recovery product and I used this years ago and I was so obsessed with it and I tried so many other things, but this is still my number one. I still come back to it. I used to sell them in Bath and Body Works and I haven't seen them there lately. I actually found it on Amazon this time and it had prime shipping, so that was A-OK -okay with me but it is just a really thick, heavy shea butter overnight lip treatment that like I can still feel it on my lips when I wake up in the morning. And I love that, that I know it's actually sitting on there and working throughout the night. It's super heavy, super moisturizing, and no matter how dried out your lips are, in the morning they will feel amazing after you use this. The next skincare item I have is from The Body Shop. This is one of their body butters and this is the Cocoa Butter. I love the scent of Cocoa Butter. I think it's just so warm and clean and it's not perfumey. I slather my hands and feet with this before bed and I swear my hands and feet are like perfect in the morning. 
so thick and hydrating that I don't like to wear it like around the house in the daytime because it is a little bit um, oily. But at night, I put this on my hands and feet right before I get in bed and I just find that it really soaks in and moisturizes even my dry, dry feet and makes them feel incredible. I also sometimes use this when I'm doing self tanning on areas like my elbows, my wrists, my hands, my knees, just so those super dry areas don't soak up too much uh, self tanner. This next item I'm totally obsessed with. It's something brand new and it's been going out of stock on the website. So hopefully it's back in stock when I post this, but it is from Teeny Blends and it is their Soothe Tea Infused Oil. If you guys can see, there's actual lavender and sage and tea leaves in the oil, which I think is so cool. I love Teeny because they do all natural ingredients. Everything is pure. There's no additives and chemicals and extra in it. So this is a lavender, sage, coconut, tea oil for your skin. It helps to reduce redness and inflammation. It soothes the skin, it helps prevent dark spots, damage, helps prevent anti-aging and wrinkles. And it's just a really nice hydrating oil on the skin. I've been using this as my last step before I put my moisturizer on morning and night and my face doesn't get overly greasy. I used it before I did my makeup today. I find that my skin is just very hydrated, very plump, very soothed, and it just smells incredible too. So the smell of it is amazing. I am totally obsessed with this stuff. I've been recommending it to so many people and a bunch of my friends have already grabbed it and love it too. So if you guys are looking for a new facial oil, definitely check this one out. I am forever addicted to sheet masks. I freaking love sheet masks. Your skin just feels so like cool and amazing and like hydrated and infused when you take them off. And lately I've been obsessed with these ones from Pacifica. I have two different ones. I have Disobey Time and I have the Energized Glow. So Disobey Time is, is more of your like hydrating anti-aging. So it's got hyaluronic acid, which is a power ingredient for hydration and anti-aging. It's also got pomegranate peptides, rose hip seed oil, which is great for anti-aging as well, and chamomile. This one though is my favorite, the Energized Glow. It's a turmeric mask and it also has watermelon, green tea, and hyaluronic acid, that power ingredient in it. And I find that like when I put this on, like I feel a little bit of a tingle on my skin, which I love to feel things working, but my face, looks incredible when I take this off. It's so glowy and dewy and hydrated and it looks like I just had a facial, seriously. So I like stock up, I'm down to my last two, but like these are game changer, favorite sheet mask, hands down. So I've got several different lifestyle items to show you guys next. First of all, the ACV. I just started doing this recently and I didn't know what to expect. It was difficult. I had to kind of figure out how to do it for myself. I know there's like a million different ways to take it. I've been doing it just in half of a small cup of water with three capfuls. And then I do a little bit of um, organic ground ginger and I do a little bit of cinnamon and then I fill it up with water. And I've found that the easiest way for me to do it that I'm not getting on my teeth and it's quicker to drink is just to kind of like take my head all the way back and take large gulps in the back of my throat. Um, that's the easiest way for me to get it down. I've heard so many people, if you have recommendations for your favorite way to take ACV, please leave it in the comments because I'm always open to learning because it does not taste good but it has so many health benefits for you. And I've really noticed that I usually carry a little bit of bloating in my tummy area and my bloating has definitely subsided. I feel like my skin looks really great. Um, so far I've been really happy with the results, so I'm definitely gonna be keeping up with that. You guys know I'm obsessed with tea and speaking of this organic ground ginger, I've shown this before on here, but this is my organic lemon ginger tea. I have this at night with a little bit of raw honey, but what I started doing now, since I had this ground organic ginger, is I'm actually adding this to this after I make the tea, and it just gives it a little bit more ginger, a little bit more of a spicy kick, and ginger is like incredible for your body. It's good for digestion, it's good for inflammation, and I love this at night. Like I feel like it makes me not snack late at night and it helps me digest my food and keep everything going. And like, I'm so hooked on these two together, obsessed. So another tea that I've really been loving is I've recently gotten into mint tea. So Teamy Blends has this new refresh tea. It is a loose tea, so you will need um, some kind of tea steeper, which I got mine from Teamy Blends. Actually, they have a ton of cute options. But this tea is a mint tea and it has mango, strawberry, and rose petal inside, which is so extra that you know I'm all about it. I need it in my life, but it's so refreshing and delicious and like light. And I love mint tea because I feel like it's just very 
calming and cleansing and I just I don't know I love mint tea right now and this one's amazing because it's got like the nice fruit taste to it I absolutely love this and I love that there's literally no other ingredients in it than dried mango dried strawberry mint tea and pink rose petals that's literally it there's nothing else put in here so you know you're getting all natural ingredients and you're getting all the goodness out of those ingredients too tons of antioxidants great for digestion like this stuff is bomb and so perfect for summer so my last lifestyle item is this adorable mug from Metal Marvels. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know I did a Metal Marvels takeover on their Instagram page for the day. And this is one of my favorite items from the company. This mug is so cute. It's so glam. It's their metallic mug. It comes in gold and silver. I have the gold one. But what they did is they took all the words from their customer reviews and put them in this diamond shape. So it says like effing bad, unapologetic, independent, boss, fierce, empowered, expletive, like there's just all these amazing words in here and it's such a like empowering mug and it's so glam, so Instagram worthy and so cute. My last few items are going to be fashion related items and the first is also from Metal Marvels that I just talked about. So if you haven't seen their stuff, like they are so girl power, raw, honest, there's a lot of curse words, there's a lot of swearing. So if you're like me, like it's right up my alley. So I got this gold digger necklace and I absolutely love it. It's just a cute little heart pendant on a long chain and I freaking love this necklace. I think it's so stinking cute. They have all different ones. Some are a little more offensive than others, but if you like that, you'll love them. And then I also just got these bangles from Metal Marvels, which their bangles are amazing. My first one I ever bought, I got over a year ago and it said, darling, just f own it and I was all about it. But my two newest ones that I got, first I have the silver one that says Dog Mom AF, and it's so cute. I love stacking these. The other one I got, which I am like so in love with because I feel like this is so me and Andrew, it's be a boss, date a boss, build an empire because we both are entrepreneurs and we're all about building our businesses. And so I feel like this is so stinking cute. And these are so cute to stack with like watches and whatever. They're thin little bangles. You can do them in combination with other bracelets. You can create a stack of them. They're so cute. They're so on trend. And I love the raw messages on them. They're very female empowerment focused. And they also swear, which I love because you guys know I love to swear like a sailor. So the last few pieces of clothing I'm going to show you guys, I actually picked up for our trip to Florida that's coming up. I decided to go on a little trip to celebrate my three year sobriety anniversary, which will be on May 25th. So I'm so excited. We tried to do a little trip around that time, a little getaway. So we're going to Florida, renting the cutest house with a little in-ground pool. And I'm so excited to just go have a little escape, like float around in an in-ground pool and a flamingo floaty and just like live my best life. So the first item I got is this really cute jumpsuit from Forever 21. It is like capri, but it's baggy. I'm obsessed with jumpsuits. I think they're so cute. They're so easy to style and they're so on trend this year. And I love that this one is this neutral tone in it. So it's easy to accessorize and style. This is from Forever 21 and this was 24 bucks. So it's totally balling on a budget. We all love to shop. I want to buy so many things. But you got to keep it on a budget like this and this is great value. It's so cute on so many different body shapes. I just, this is going to be like a staple piece for my summer wardrobe. I already know. Next item I also got from Forever 21. I'm obsessed with all things kimono right now and when I saw this black and palm print kimono i was like yes it's perfect for a beach cover-up this is perfect with a tank and leggings or jeans like there's so many ways to style kimonos i feel like it's a trend that it's so easy to work into your wardrobe to up level your pieces that you already have so this was super cheap too this is from forever 21 as well it was 17 bucks like you can't go wrong with a $17 kimono. So this baby's coming to Florida as well. And then the last item I got, I actually posted on Instagram if anyone had ordered before because I was so scared if these items were gonna be like legit or not because they were so cheap. But I got them from Sheen, Shein, S-H-E-I-N, however you say that. Um, but I ordered a couple pieces from them and everything honestly came great. The item I got I'm the most excited about that I am taking to Florida is this cover up sheer dress. So I'll try to show you guys, but it's sheer, it has short sleeves, it has a drawstring waist, then the bottom has three panels. So this is like your center panel, and then these are the side panels. So it like opens at the thigh, if you guys can see. I think this is so freaking cute for the beach. Like I'm so excited to wear this to the beach. Beach or by the pool, and I think it's such a cute, chic little dress. Like this is so perfect, and it was so cheap. I don't remember exactly how much it was. I'll put it in the description bar, but I remember I was like shocked. Like this thing's gonna be a piece of shit that's that cheap. And I'm floored at what good quality it ended up being. So I'm so excited to wear this in Florida. 
and just be like extra as hell. So that's really everything I have to show today. Like I said, everything will be linked down below in the description bar and I'll have links and codes if I have discounts for you guys to save some money. But check these items out, grab the ones you want and get yourself balling on a budget. Thank you guys so much for watching this video today. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you did not already so you do not miss anything else. Let me know in the comments if you have tried any of these items, if you plan on buying any of these items or what your favorites were. Make sure you are following me on all my other social media because I post a ton of crap constantly especially on Instagram. That's where I am the most active and make sure you guys check out my podcast on iTunes if you have not checked it out yet. I love my face on the screen here per usual. If you click it, you'll be subscribed to my channel and I will also have some other videos for you guys to check out as well. But I think that is all I have to say right now. So until next time, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.